What's good, everybody? What's good, YouTube? I'm Jack, and this is Jack Reacts. Long time no see, y'all. I apologize for the delay. Life has been crazy. I'm just gonna leave it leave it at that. We're not gonna go more into that. But uh, we're back in the reactions, man. We got for today. Tank can't let it show. And big shout out to Big Dom for the request on this one. I appreciate the love and support. I'm, I like I like the name as well. Uh, music video on this one. If the video gets blocked, y'all know the drill. Um, I'll have to obscure it a little bit. And listen, man, if you're watching, you want to further support the channel, have me react to a song or live performance of your choice. Like I said, I'm back with the reactions, man. Um, click the link down below, send me your song. I'll react to it and shout you out in the video. Um, but nonetheless, got Tank Man. I just reacted to him not too, too long ago. And I haven't done all that much of him on the channel. I think that's why uh, we're reacting to him now because I asked for some more Tank. So yeah, I'm excited to get into it. Let's get into it, man. No more talking. Oh, that's a, uh, that's Maxwell, no? Or is that like a sample? It might be, maybe that's him singing, but like that sounded exactly like This Woman's Worth, no? Ain't that the song? Or am I tripping? Or it might just be a falsetto that sounds similar. How did I lose you? How did I blow that? How can we go back? Why did hey. I not choose you? Uh, instead of a good time, I wasted your good time. I should have been everything I promised. I should have not had to turn it from this. Nice. You should have been first. I know it's emotional, but you're not emotional. She said, I should be Hey, Tank's killing this falsetto. Also, sorry, sorry, I don't mean to pause right there. I'm going to run it back a little bit. But, yeah, killing it on the falsetto. But I like how also the falsetto part is in the woman's perspective. So he's he, he's, he's kind of talking from the voice of this woman here. And that's reflected in the video. And then when he, he's doing the woman part, he's doing the falsetto. And I, I don't think it's necessarily to be like, oh, he's singing as a woman. So he's making his voice high. I think it's just the falsettos in the song, but I think it was a cool creative take to be like, to, to, to make it the falsetto where it's it's coming from like the woman's perspective. I, I really rock with these melodies. I'm really rocking with the vibe. Tank Tank is one of those like Brian McKnight, like in, in that he's, he's going to come with the slow jams, right? We know that. I like that this is obviously a little bit newer too compared to the other songs I've done. I've, if I had to guess, I'm gonna say, oh, it's just two years ago. Okay, so yeah, it's new, new. I and I and I could tell immediately with the production in the video, uh, and this is fire, but it still has that old school R&B feel to it as well, but definitely modern in a good way. I'm rocking with this heavy. This is great. I like the flow. I should have been everything I promised. I should have not had to learn it from this. You should have been first. Oh my God. I know it's emotional, but you're not emotional. She said, I like that line. Dude, this is this shit's a hit, and I gotta I want to get Tank a couple props here. One, his voice aged incredibly. Not that he's that old, you know what I mean. He's probably in his forties or something, but like, still, you know, it, it, it's easier said than done to have your voice still sound killer, especially on a falsetto in your forties. You know what I mean? I, I know plenty of artists that were amazing when they were you know 18 19 20 21 22 but you know 42 45 46 52 doesn't hit the same this hits the same though so i want to give him props there secondly i want to also give him props on um 
just how great this sounds in a newer song, which is another big pet peeve of mine. I hate to say it, but so many R&B legends that I love, man, you know, Smokey Rob. Sorry, I love Smokey Robinson, man. Legend, and we can't take anything away from him. But if y'all listen to some of the newer Smokey Robinson songs, man, <laughs> it's just it's not it, it's a little it's a little corny. It's a little corny, and I mean that in a respectful way. Uh, what's what's that one Smokey song? Gang banging, gang. Go look up Smokey Robinson gang banging. You'll know what I'm talking about. It's just well, a, a lot of the legends just they try to like adapt to like the modern time and it ends up warping the sound it's just like keep keep the sound that you got there's nothing wrong with it. if you're a soul artist or a slow jam artist you can still do that in 2024 so i'm glad that he stuck to a slow jam the beat sounds a little bit fresher a little bit newer but it's still a slow jam it's still r&b he's not a bit on, on a trap beat you know doing the most i love that he's keeping like what he knows and making it a little bit new don't love it Cause if it hurts, I know you still care Cause if you don't, I know you're alright Oh, please, yeah So that I know you're feeling something fierce Cause if it hurts, I know you still care Cause if you don't, then I know you're over it Oh, she said, she said, she said Hard. This shit's hard. This is a great melody too. It's very catchy. Mmm. Mmm. Damn. Ooh, I like that. That outro was nice. He can sing. He's he's got. It's not just that he can hit the notes, but he also just has a really natural, like like someone like a Luther Vandross who just has just the. Even if he was just talking, he sounds good. You get what I'm saying? I love the outro. I like the keys on it too. It it sounded like a like an '80s outro. I mean that as a compliment. Yeah, this was a ten out of ten. Also love the fact that not only was this great, but it's got a good amount of love on it. 12 million views for two years is not bad at all. That's that's like that's up there with damn near Drake numbers. 12, 12 million in two years, especially for an R and B song, is great. That's great numbers. So I'm I'm glad that this song got got uh got its flowers. Is what I'm trying to say, because it deserves it. As far as newer R and B songs, so I'll say R and B songs for the last 10 years is what I'll call newer. This is up with one of the best I've heard. And I've reacted to a lot of newer R&B songs. I know most of what I do is older, but listen, I've done a lot of songs on the channel. So, you know, I've gotten around to my, my newer ones too. This is up there. This was fire. Shout out to Tank, man. Very impressed. Thank you to Big Dom for the request as well. I appreciate the love and support. And listen, man, if you're watching, there's a song or live performance you want me to check out as well. Click that link down below. Send me your song. I'll react to it and shout you out in the video. Listen, man, y'all have a blessed day, blessed night, and peace.